Okay, today we have the Snapfire 8. It's the newest addition to Nerf Start Tagline, and it's a pretty nifty little blaster. Um, one main thing about it is it only requires one hand to operate. There's no priming anywhere. Um, you fire it just by pulling the trigger, which rotates the 8 dart uh, turret here into place and operates the plunger. Down here you can see there's an indicator for speed or power, and then on the bottom here there's a knob that adjusts the tension of the internal spring. So on the speed setting, uh, the trigger pulls a little easier, but the ranges aren't quite as good. And when you've got it cranked down to power, uh, it's a little bit harder to fire the trigger, but the ranges are better. And we'll be doing a test on both speed and power, uh, starting off with speed. As you notice, two of the shots didn't fire. Sometimes you notice that'll happen where the turret doesn't actually move, and if you just keep pulling the trigger, it will. Okay, there's 10 on the speed setting for the Snapfire 8. See how it did? Pretty consistent. And starting here with the low one, the lowest one right here, right about at 20 feet as we work our way up. Call the middle 20, yeah, 24 feet. And we've got the top ones up here. And that's coming in at a bit over 27 feet. So we're gonna say top shot for the speed setting on the Snapfire 8 is 27 feet. Let's reset and see how it does on the power setting. Okay, so we've done the speed range test for the Snapfire 8. Now we're going to change it over from speed to power. Do that by twisting this knob down here. You can see the indicator is changing from speed to power as it puts more tension on the spring. Okay, got it all cranked down here. And let's see how the ranges go. There we go. And now with those shots where it's not firing, I've noticed that uh, you got to be real careful that you let the trigger go all the way back forward or that turret not rotating thing seems to happen more often. And now the range is in the power setting. Okay, this lowest run right here. Work that up. It's a bit over 28 feet, so right there we've already surpassed the uh, top shot for the speed setting. As we work our way up through the group. Let's see, gonna call the middle, or a bunch of these fell about 35 feet. So we work our way up to the top here. Got this one right here. That one landed right about 40 feet. So, top shot for the uh, Snapfire 8 in power mode, 40 feet. Pretty impressive.